St. Lucia has repeatedly been awarded the world's leading honeymoon destination. This absolutely breathtaking island has been home to many visitor weddings along the shores of our white sand beaches. Natalie John, a longtime designer for weddings, gives us her take on St. Lucia's well-deserved award. For the past couple of years, we've been voted the number one uh, honeymoon and wedding destination. And even when you look at the um, statistics from the U.S. market, which Condé Nast and Fairchild Bride uh, produces every year, uh, you, the Caribbean is still a number one destination in the world for weddings and honeymoons. And when you break down that segment into islands, the St. Lucia is always in the top three. My inspiration when I look back, I would probably say, um, now that I'm already in the market, I normally look to Preston Bailey. He is like the event designer. He does Oprah's birthday parties. He did Donald Trump's wedding and so forth. When you see his work, you're like, wow. But I must say for, for St. Lucia, I, we have what we call our own Preston Bailey by the name of uh, Sean Greaves. He does all our wedding decor and, and so forth. And we also use him in the other islands that if we have a client who needs a particular decor, we would fly him to, to that island to do the work. So I think um, we have somebody in terms of Preston Bailey that who we aspire to become. And we also have somebody of our own that we think can get us there as well. Right. It lived up to all my expectations of what I wanted. The, the people are friendly, uh, the location is beautiful, and it's just a good day to get married. From the taxi drivers, the cake makers, the florists, because the wedding industry on a whole captures many different uh, vendors. So it's not just we who are in the planning business, but you're looking for other areas where they have the reception, the chairs that they would rent if they have in the wedding on the beach, cutlery, you name it, it encompasses so much more and I think that um, if persons have not, that it is certainly an opportunity for persons to look into what aspect they could get into.